Loomers, it's Amanda and Monica Loomy, and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create a hook only design called Enchanted Hearts. As you can see here, some of the renditions that we've already made. And this is going to be the, the blinged version. Uh, you can do this uh, either way. You don't have to add bling, it's just something that I chose to do. But um, I'm not going to show you in this tutorial how to bling it, I'm just going to show you how to create the bracelet. Okay? So, and I want to apologize uh, ahead of time that um, if we are doing a tutorial for a friend of ours on Instagram or any, any of our other looming friends, we always um, try to share with the, them their Instagram page or whatever that they typically post from. But I do have to apologize and say that all of my iOS devices are being occupied right now. I'm filming with my phone and my son's iPad, my daughter's iPad, iPod, and the other additional iPod are either dead or being used. So um, I don't have anything to share uh, as far as who the creator of this bracelet was, but I can tell you their name. They are on Instagram and they are noticed as Mr. Crafter. So look them up on Instagram give them a shout out and give them a follow. So what you'll need today is obviously a hook. Whatever amount of bands you want to use, you can see that I've just used two, two colors for this, three colors for this one, and then I've used four over here and four for this one. So um, it, it's kind of a, a limitless design as far as colors are concerned. So go ahead and get your colors, your hook, and your C-clip as well, and come back and we'll get started, all right? Okay, so my editing skills are not that great on iMovie yet, so I'm working on that. But anyway, I'm just going to uh, walk you through the very first step, and then the video will kind of uh, start over again and um, walk you through that step pretty quickly um, because I didn't mess up uh, my first spot. So anyway, you'll start with uh, one band. You are going to cap that, pull the same color band through, then you're going to grab your next color, put it on the hook, pull that through just like that, and then this is where we get to the part of the bracelet that we are going to flip it. All right. If you have a double ended hook, you can slide it down. But when you use these uh, different bands like this that are thicker, you can just flip it around. I'm going to repeat this step on this side. And then this is what your bracelet should look like. So the next step, what we're going to do is we're going to hold these here, remove that, grab your next color, hold that, pull both of those middle bands over. Replace that purple one and put that one back on the hook too. Grab the same color chain that you have in the middle or it can be different, whichever. We're going to repeat that step. And that's what you should have. Now grab your two smaller heart colors. Just going to take that on the outside. That blue one doesn't need to go up. Should look like so. We don't want those to cross either. Just be on the outside. Around the outside, around the outside. Okay. And we're going to flip. Grab the other red. Pull through. Just like we did. And there you have the first hearts, first enchanted hearts. Grab uh, the color that you started with, the cat band colors, and we're gonna pull all of those through. Now in the next part of this clip of the video, it's gonna go through rather quickly what I just showed you, because like I said, I had kind of messed up um, on my part. So I tried to edit it out and then I ended up losing uh, everything I just recorded. So anyway, I uh, need some uh, YouTube lessons on iMovie. 
Yes, note to self and editing. I thought I was getting pretty good at that, but apparently I edited the wrong clip. I edited out the whole part that I was supposed to leave in and left the clip that I was gonna take out. So anyway, enough about that. So this will be your first uh, set of enchanted hearts. And then, like I said, the next clip is just gonna kinda jump right in. So I apologize for any inconvenience and I hope you can follow. All right, cap that band there. Pull through, like I just told you before. Pull that through. I'm gonna try to edit that other little piece out. If I don't, I'm, I'll apologize ahead of time. Okay. So we're at this point, we're removing this one off, putting this one in or on, I should say. Reclaiming, reclaiming. We've got those two there, and this is where we're adding our single chain. In the middle. Make sure you got a good grip of everything or else you're gonna lose it. Just like I did. And there we have the very uh, first part. Now we're going to take our third color, red. I think red is appropriate for the heart. And we are just going to put it on the outside bands, just like that. And that's going to make the smaller heart on the inside. And we are going to flip. Make sure all your bands are in order. And that's what you should have. Now we're gonna take the green that we started with and we're gonna pull all of those through. Now you can kinda work the bands to get their shape back. So you've got your larger heart here, single chain in the middle, and then your small hearts here. And we're just gonna repeat that. So our green is where we started. We're gonna grab the blue next. Just like so. And replace that. That's what you should have. Pinch and twist. Or if you have a double ended hook, you can do that. Just slide it all the way down the end if you have the double-ended hook. So now we have those two. Taking that off, we're gonna be putting the purple in the middle, that first single chain. Replacing that. I'm gonna leave that hanging there because I'm gonna grab another one. And put that back on, reclaim, reclaim. So now we're gonna make our smaller hearts, the red ones. Just like that, take it and flip. just like that and we're gonna pull everything through like I said this is very very easy it's a very very cute design perfect uh, for gifts for teachers for Valentine's Day just throwing that out there um, there you know this takes not a whole lot of time to make the bracelet so it would be a cute gift or even just uh, for your kids to exchange them for Valentine's or whatever or you know obviously I'll be wearing one on my wrist so or just to wear 
So I'm gonna show you one more time this pattern and then I'll let you complete yours. Hook on one side, pinch, and flip. Repeat that pattern on this side. Grab your single chain color. Take this one off. Put everything down, pull those over. Replace that, and then replace that. Grab the other single chain color. Take this off again. We're gonna hook and put those on. Just like that. Just hook on the outside. And this is where we're gonna flip for the last time. And we will pull through. And there you have your enchanted heart design. I'll finish mine off and we'll just close it out when we get back. Alrighty. Happy Lumi. Alright, so I have finished my bracelet to the desired length that I want. We're going to just close it off. Very, very simple. Uh, you need The last step that you need to have is the very last one to pull you before you pull that single band through. That's what you need to have uh, where you need to leave it. So to, just to close it, instead of the single band pulling it through, uh, we're going to use double bands. Uh, it just holds that bracelet a little bit more secure and we just like that feel. So we don't want to, you know, we say this in all of our tutorials. We don't want you to create all these and then you have a band snap and then your creation fall off your arm which I have been at work and looked down and there's like bands laying in my lap and I'm like oh what's that from and then I look it's the bracelet that I was wearing but anyway happens to us all uh, you know we wear them out they get snug or stuck on something and you know pull apart so it, it, it happens so we just come home and fix them so anyway this is what we're gonna do we're just gonna attach our C clip And you know what? I have to pause this because I'm going to have to get a bigger C clip. I always end up needing the big ones and I've always got the small ones. I'll be right back, guys. I've got my big C clip. This one, not going to work. Not so much. So we got to grab the wide one. And for those that you don't know where you can find the wide ones, they'll be in your specialty bands. Um, the uh, dual layered, most of those come in there. So or your limited edition. Actually, I think in limited edition, edition, they just have regular size. I may be wrong. Alrighty. So I just like to kind of go through and separate them. And there you have your enchanted heart hook only design. Thank you so much for watching and make sure you follow Mr. Crafter on Instagram if you are a user of Instagram and please hit that like button if you like this bracelet and this tutorial. Please follow us on Instagram and hashtag us at Amanda and Monica or Lumi and tag us as well. So uh, the bracelet that I'm wearing today, uh, this little thing that we've started to do is tell everybody what we're wearing because everybody asks on our channel. This is the pedal bracelet. Uh, this tutorial is uh, on our channel as well. Five Kids Calls Chaos is the designer of this bracelet. This one actually does have the borders and uh, I love this one very, very, very much. So fits flat on your wrist. You can wear it just nice and flat and nice and snug and uh, it's very comfortable. A very comfortable bracelet. So check that out and you guys have a wonderful day, night, evening, morning, whichever it is in your uh, time of time of the world. So happy looming and rainbow loom for a cause.